we were talking about colorful vegetables and polyphenols and how critical those are. And I love talking about polyphenols. I love colorful foods in my diet. I love extra virgin olive oil, things like that. So all about polyphenols. Let's talk more about that. Yeah, it's super important because I, I, that's the biggest bang for your buck when it comes to eating for therapeutic diets that are going to control that inflammation we we're talking about yeah. and, and the oxidative stress. So getting those in like Aronia berries are one of my favorite new hacks because, you know, I used to be like blueberries, 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 and all berries, but aronia berries, right? So their mm -hmm. ORAC value or the amount of antioxidants contained in these things, and they're almost like they're savory in a sense, right? But there's so many recipes I can make aronia berry salsa, but getting those colors in full of polyphenols, full of then antioxidants to decrease that oxidative stress and inflammation, super important. And if you're stressed, stretched as far as time, right? Or the hecticness is not going to calm down anytime soon. You know, a supplement is just add, it, it just means that you're adding something to what is already there mm -hmm. to enhance it, right? So if you can't spend a good amount of time with self-care and meal prep and thinking through the food that you're going to nourish yourself with, then choose a quality supplement that you can get some of these things in. That's important. Yeah. yeah just throw sure. the baby out with the bathwater if what we're saying just wants to push you over the edge because you're like, I don't have any time to get any more food in or to get any more quality food or colorful food in. So think about supplementation. Yeah. And what I found is that diversity, like th there are certain staples and favorites that I love, things like a high polyphenol extra virgin olive oil, for example, eating berries, things like that. But, uh, you know, the research out there, especially when it comes to microbiome research or research is the greater the diversity, meaning like you're getting a lot of different types of these polyphenols from different types of vegetables the healthier your microbiome is going to be. So getting a large kind of variety of different things is key. But like you mentioned, most of us are eating really the same things. We eat like the same 12 foods every single week. And part of that is because we're busy. We don't really want to try to experiment. We don't have the time. We feel like it's stressful yeah. to, to go and try to get new stuff at the grocery store. Um, and so that's where, you know, taking some sort of like a blend, like I know that with pure health research that you guys that you work with they created this this uh, metabolic reds which is you know got this whole array of polyphenol rich plants in it it's got digestive enzymes probiotics whole bunch of like powerful different uh you know little systems that are in this this is helpful because you can just take a scoop of this in some water it tastes great and you're supporting your microbiome your digestive health your telomeres your mitochondria it's got all those support nutrients to really uh, to to help your body deal with this without having to you know add in five new fruits and vegetables that you've never tried before. Yeah, you're making great points. I mean, this is one of the things that you said before. I, I want to jump onto the metabolic reds thing. Um, is that diversity association? And you're correct. In the research, it's correlated to better health co uh, health outcomes across the board. Okay, and this is my one little sentence hack for that: eat locally, and then uh seasonally yeah. right so supporting those organic farmers that bring those nice produces to your farmers market assures you or growing your own food that's even better mm -hmm. assures you that you have this variety built in if it's seasonal right because crops will change and if it's local that means that they haven't been shipped from you know the you know three thousand miles away to get to your grocery store to get them to your plate, right? They're they're more nutrient dense. So that's super important. And that diversity, I couldn't agree with you more. And then, yeah, you know, supplement your lifestyle. Um, that's what I've always said. You know, if people are uh, in the habit of taking a glass of wine at night and that that's just their wind down, right? Well, milk thistle can protect, help protect your liver, right? If you know that you are firing at all cylinders and that stress is a big part and you've got inflammatory processes or you've been diagnosed with something, then supplement your lifestyle. And you're right. One of the things that about the metabolic uh, reds that really just got my attention was that when we talk about telomeres, there's an enzyme called 
telomerase or telomerase, okay? Yeah. And that enzyme, it maintains the health of your telomeres. And so there was a study, I think it was published in Nature, that was that journal. Harvard, Harvard scientists actually, um, the, the blend that is contained in the metabolic reds helps to activate this enzyme. So we're working synergistically, not only with the probiotic blend to balance out and maintain that integrity of your microbiome, the digestive enzyme blend, so you've got that support so you don't have to work so hard if your digestive system is compromised, a polyphenol organic red fruit blend, right? So you've got those built-in antioxidants and this adaptogenic blend, that's where this mm. activation of the telomerase comes in and it starts to help protect your telomeres. And so it pretty much works on those three biological clocks we were sort of highlighting, your telomeres, your microbiome, your mitochondria, it's all right in there. And a scoop a day, don't yeah. by all means just go on with the rest of your life. Try to implement the things you talked about as far as like decreasing EMFs, decreasing blue light, making sure your diet is diverse, but supplement your lifestyle.